you know, if this movie isn't like a literal passing of the torch, I don't know what is. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how? what was your guys' reaction to reading how this movie ends, which I think we could spoil, sees Nika sort of possessed with the spirit of Charles Lee Ray? I don't know what it what you know what it, you know what the next movie. I mean, do you do you mean are they going to hire me to do the to continue to do Chucky? No, I just think what was your reaction when you found out that that's how this movie was going to end and that Fiona... sounded like a cool ending. <laughs> yeah, was it was it a little bit anything? Do you remember what what it, what it's like to to have the iconic character that you've embodied passed along to your kid? That we like was it was it exciting but also weird and strange. Actually, we've never had this conversation. <laughs> well, I don't. I mean, um, hmm, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. No. Did you read the whole? Did you, yeah, you read I read it. it. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Of oh. course I did. Yeah, <laughs> had to. No, it wasn't weird at all. Wasn't weird. Well, I think that we we it was we had a fun conversation about how to play Chucky, which I was, you know, it was surreal and fun. Um, and Chucky is a thought, is a thought, thought out character in a way um, that uh, I think a lot of horror franchises don't have. And the conversation that we had, what makes Chucky tick? I think it's Why really don't you say it since... But it, I think it's your, your, it's your invention. Yeah, but you can say it because you, you did it. So we had this conversation, and and it it turns out that the driving force, Chucky's engine, is that he's scared of oblivion, which is something that I can I'm, I can relate to. Um, I think we all can, but it was it, it gave this real existential meaning to him, and I think uh, and then I could make it my own. So I, I he, my dad helped me get, get inside of it. <laughs> that has to be such a juicy opportunity for you because so you've grown up with this character just as well as we all have and uh, now you're playing Charles Lee Ray um, how again surreal <laughs> but like how much fun was that when you were on set doing that <laughs> I mean it was so fun so so Chucky movies are really really fun to make also Don from making Curse of Chucky has become I think my best friend <laughs> awesome. he's like he's actually I mean he is like the person that I talk to the most on the phone, you know, there's like two people that you can call and just be like, I'm bored, sit on the phone with me. Um, and Don has become that person in my life. We spend holidays together. And uh, so the, the movies are really, really fun to make. Uh, it's fun to have something written for you and it's fun to make something with somebody you're that close to. And then that it got to be, that I got to play my dad's iconic character. <laughs> And that he's so active and he's having so much fun, you know? Um, it's just, it, it felt like a revenge fantasy. Um, yeah, man, it's the coolest thing I got to do in my whole life. <laughs> Is it consistently surprising to you? I mean, you're used to it by now, but just how popular the character remains and how devoted the fan base is. It is. It's, it's, um, it's, it's surprising. But it's really, you know, uh, based on Don Mancini's, uh, uh, the, how seriously he takes the the responsibility of keeping the um, the whole thing alive, and um, and by doing something different with it each time. Yeah, and it's incredible. You don't see that the same guy responsible for almost every movie. And for you're every involved, single movie, for not every almost. single movie, yeah. yeah. I mean, everything gets rebooted or remade, but these guys, you're still going with it, and it's so great. Yeah. And the horror fans appreciate that too. And, and that we're, we, I don't think that any movie has completely disregarded what's happened before. I mean, Chucky stays true to its franchise and true to its different themes. It's a pretty yeah. tangled web. Here. It's a <laughs> tangled web, and it's smart. Yeah. I mean, I think like I, 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 I think that. For this being the seventh installment of a horror franchise that's thirty years old, and that it still feels this fresh, I and I get that I'm here to promote the movie, but I'm I'm legitimately really excited by it and behind it. I just think that the tone of this movie was so successful. Yeah, <laughs> I just really I'm I, I just really think it's good. And he's really designed it in a way that he can kind of do anything next. You know, he could take it in any direction. Yeah. And have both you and Chucky in the same place. Yeah, and you. Yeah, like, 
two trippies yeah. in a weird way. Yeah, I know. That's going to be a trip. <laughs> I feel so lucky. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you have any idea what's coming up next? I, I don't think that we do. I know that it won't be Chucky in space, so let's Phew. dispel that rumor. Okay. <laughs> I know. Okay with that. No, I, I think that uh, I think I think Don is very thoughtful and very smart, and I think that uh, what he does will stay true to the themes that have been. He created. doesn't have an idea yet. No. And I don't think he. I think he will... has a ton of ideas actually. Yeah, yeah, but he doesn't have a real. Yeah. There's no and, outline. <laughs> and he but. won't. Until he comes up with something he really believes in, he won't have a movie. And yes. um, and it could be a million different things. He's he had uh, from the from uh, the seed days and and so forth. He had a great movie which he had to abandon, but it would have been it could have been you can't you can't do it now. Well, so I'm... so he's had he's had magnificent ideas. Um, uh, of really fun, of really fun Chucky movies, but um, until he has one that he's really crazy about, it won't happen. And I know he'll come up with something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's not a sausage factory. We'll wait a few years. Until yeah, that's we get okay. To think I'm it. excited to see it. I was six. My babysitter was murdered. And they never caught him? Justice was done. Wanna play? Mika, the murders were real. Chucky never was. That's right. He was a fantasy, a delusion. Are you feeling better now? I don't blame you for being afraid. I was very ill. Chucky told me he's coming for you. It's important that we all explore it together as a group. I think I have something that will help. Whoa. Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna play? First, he'll kill each and every one of you in the most horrible ways you can imagine. And then he'll kill me, too. Come to mommy. Oh, God. Are you afraid of the truth? Terrified. You should be, too. Night, night. <laughs> and they call me sick? Wait a minute, there's two of them? A true classic never goes out of style. <laughs>